A tense security situation continues in Judea and Samaria. The long holiday weekend included the infiltration of a settlement by an armed terrorist who was neutralized by a security guard outside a synagogue during prayer services. ILTV Steve Leibovich reports. The security situation remains tense in Judea and Samaria amid terror attempts and IDF initiatives to raid terrorist cells before they can attack. On Friday morning, a terrorist armed with a knife was killed after attempting an attack outside the synagogue of the small community of Tene Omarim near Hebron. After infiltrating through the security fence, the terrorist headed for the community synagogue, where holiday prayer was underway. He was shot by security guards before causing any injuries. Earlier, the IDF staged the raid in the Aqaba Jabba refugee camp near Jericho. Eight Palestinian combatants were injured during the raid. Security forces cordoned off the area before raiding buildings in search of wanted terrorists. Gun battles erupted. No soldiers were injured. The IDF said troops came under gunfire as well as Palestinians hurling stones and Molotov cocktails. IDF forces responded with live fire and riot dispersal means. The army said troops detained Palestinians suspected of involvement in terror activities and arms sales. In a separate IDF raid, security forces arrested a Palestinian fugitive accused of carrying out a shooting attack against a bus carrying soldiers in the Jordan Valley in September 2022. Maher Torkman, along with his son and nephew, opened fire at the bus from a passing vehicle, seriously injuring a soldier and the civilian driver, and lightly wounding five other soldiers. The trio attempted to then set fire to the bus. In the process, their car caught fire. Meyer's son died of his wounds, and his nephew was arrested by troops. Meyer managed to flee the scene. He was on the run until his arrest. During the holiday weekend, there were isolated clashes reported between Jewish and Palestinian residents of Judea and Samaria. IDF intervention was required to restore order.